amazing shifter builder, guys. Boys from Elevated are here. Yes, we, we are. are. We're gonna build a power steering hose for the Golden Nugget. We'll get going. What do you know, All right, let's see if Scott's the guy that scratches this first. Ain't gonna be me. <laughs> so these guys have a mobile crimping setup. They didn't bring the whole trailer with them today. They just brought their semi-mobile <laughs> <That's right. laughs> setup right here is awesome way better than what i got which is absolutely nothing <laughs> i got some pliers these guys are going off of me snapchatting them a couple of times right here so Hopefully yeah Hopefully. we'll see if we got all the right parts and pieces that we need all right so first casualty is my fault <laughs> i told them number eight it's a number 10. They're just putting the finishing touches on this hose, crimping the last side on it. Let's test it. Oh, Bandu, yeah. JSC 90. It's gonna be awesome. All right, there's finished product. Tucks in there nice. You can't even see where it hooks because it's clear down in there, buried deep, but it's hooked. All right, these guys got the golden nugget all handled. So all the hoses are on the power steering, should work good. We just gotta get some wiring in it so we can test it out. Thank you, Elevated. Thank you, sir. Absolutely. Yep. Several days later. So the hosers, or Elevated, send us the power steering hose. We can figure this out. I think we're gonna have to heat this up and over bend this. It's a 90 right now, and I think we're gonna need like a 120 or 30 out of it to make this fit where we need it to. We'll see. Let's go uh, heat up a brand new fitting and see if we can ruin it. I think we heat that up right around. Whoa! Whoa! Whoa. I jumped! <laughs> I like it. You jumped again, Randall! Let's see if it's perfect. Oh, it's gonna be perfect. Randall, are you prepared for how good this is? I'm prepared. It's almost perfect. Look at that angle. It's like we knew what we were doing. I'm talking about. All right. It's in. Scott, Taylor, okay. I don't know if we're as professional as you boys, but it's in. On that truck. You know you're getting somewhere when fluid starts going in stuff. <laughs> Power steering, check. All right, today, on the gold nugget. We're still working on it, continually working on it. We're narrowing it down. We're getting some stuff handled. We're gonna go through our list here and figure out what we've done, what we still have to do, and try to get some stuff knocked off, really. We've got power steering is done. E-brake is done. Winch controller, winch is partially done. Controller still needs. Rad hoses are done, but we don't like them. We gotta redo those kind of. coming, some different ones. Battery box and tie down, done. Wiring, not done, but getting done. Wipers, done. done. Shifter, not mm. done. Dash and cluster, done. done. Interior, not done. Mm. Lights, done. done. Fuel lines and filler neck, done. done. Drive line, done. Overflow bottle, not mm. done. Air filter, not done. Mm. Ashtray is, uh, going in you guys have spoke ashtray wins i guess first things first we ought to go find a shifter our next major hurdle is this shifter right here so we've got to figure something out i'll show you what we have this is the shifter we have i've never liked it from uh, day one really it just doesn't fit where it needs to it's way farther back we need one that's lower farther forward so we've decided this is out so we're gonna cruise up to my buddy's house and we're gonna go see if we can find something out of another car that will fit in here and work. So we're gonna take a little drive and go check it out. Away we go. We'll go see if Billy's home. We're still hunting him. He's not. 
not at his house, so we'll go look elsewhere. Bailing hay. He's right there. We'll go down and find him in the field. Looks like you're going to get a little hay on the first cut. And about a quarter of what I usually get. Will this feed your feed them all year? So if you don't get a good one on the next one, yeah, you're in I'm trouble? Yeah, I'm screwed. I'm screwed. Well, got to rain. Okay, we'll cruise up and go see if we can okay. find a shifter. Okay. All right, thank you, sir. Yeah, take care, guys. Yep. <laughs> Love you, man. Love you, too. I'll give you guys a little sneak peek of a junkyard that I've had access to my whole life. I've known the guy that owns it, Billy, forever. He's got some sweet cars. You're probably gonna see one of his pride and joys in my shop before long. We're gonna put some exhaust on it. It's a 57 Chev, two door, pretty sweet car. This junkyard's got a lot of history in it because all these cars are from town, basically. They're people I knew that drove them around, so pretty cool. Been up here a lot as you can tell oh yeah right there that is an amc eagle and i'm pretty sure it's an automatic you go check for bees here dude this is a bees you don't and rattlesnakes just, you don't want to just dive into any of this stuff all right well that my friend that's looking pretty good isn't it looks like it ought to work this stuff isn't for sale this is his personal stash. He uses it for parts. I use it for parts. Select few use it for parts. If you know, you know. That's kind of how I say. And there's some cool stuff here. How do we get that off? Very carefully. Oh, I don't know if you realize who you're talking to, <laughs> but very careful in me. Our we're, best friend. We're not the best of buddies. <laughs> I've tried to become friends with him, but he doesn't like me. Prime. Oh yeah. Have I mentioned how hot it is in this car? I mean, I think I'm like almost to the surface of the sun right now. Oh, got it. Hold that. We got what we came for. It was fairly easy, really. I was expecting way harder than that. Go over here and I'll show you a car. Here's the old Grim Reaper car. There'd be this thing. Grandpa Sherm painted the Grim Reaper on the side of it for me. Where it ended up. Stripped it and that's where it went. I remember him painting that on there like it was yesterday. Yeah. My old Opal. I owned this once. I owned that too. We did some pretty gnarly burnouts in that car a few times. That was pretty, yeah, another, that's an Impala Derby. Go back through easy, does it? This right here is the truck that pretty much started it all for us. She was a good one. We crashed a lot of stuff with that thing. Getting some little rice burners over here. See what they got. That was once my truck. About this little green one. It's an automatic. Huh. Going in. Oh, Phillips screwdriver, Milan. What year? 87. 2000. <laughs> well, it's 2700 degrees in this car too. I'll bet this one's hotter. Holy geez, I'm sweating. <laughs> We're gonna figure out which one of these shifters we like the best. This car's just crusher bait anyway one day, but as long as Billy's alive, these cars are never going to get crushed. He let a crusher come in when I was in high school. And the guy was crooked. And he wasn't here watching him one day. And he crushed a whole bunch of 60s Mopars and stuff that weren't supposed to get crushed. So, moral of the story is... is They're not welcome here anymore. They are not welcome here. Okay, well, that's a different sorts of a shifter too. Alright, land. Shifter. 
Let's uh, don't break this stuff, nor lose it. All right, let's go back and build a shifter. I guess let's go see which one of these we like best and works best and we'll get to building the shifter. Looks like Jace is winning. <laughs> I wouldn't say that. She fixed? No. She will be. Like you guys succeeded. We've got two. Oh yeah. Well we'll, we've got we'll take the take the best parts of everything and put it in. Well, this one yeah, came this. out of an AMC Eagle, that one came out of an M3 BMW. And just in case you're wondering, it feels a lot cooler in here than it did up there. That car was 1400 degrees, maybe 2700 degrees. Let's see if we can make this work. Yeah, we get that lubed up, that may, that may start working. What do you think of that? Looks like it ought to work to me. The cover is going to have to get a lot done to it. Oh yeah, that's nasty. We'll clean that Just up. Just pull it clear apart, pull all that stuff out and we'll soak it. Get it cleaned up and then she'll run. I'm trying to decide which one's going to be best. That one I think is our best option. Plus this one's a squeeze thing here and shift it. I kind of like that better. We're trying to figure out the, the geometry of this throw so that it shifts properly. So if I measure from the center of this shift rod to the center of that, and we measure from the center of here to wherever, drill the hole and put it back in, it should be the same. Should be the same. Uh, gonna love it. It's gonna yeah, work. It's gonna work. It's gonna work awesome. You know what might be a good idea? Which it's gonna be. This bolts into that floor right now. Oh, did you have an idea? I'm, I'm calculating one as we, as I'm talking through it right now. Just gonna go ahead and. So we this. built this to bolt into the floor originally. What if we just take and take this out of it, take all the shifter stuff out, cut the hole out, put this one into this plate, bolt in, and then these are welded. We'll have to cut these rivets out and pull it all out of there, but. Gut it yeah, and then we can floor, place it where we wherever want. Wherever we want it in there. And we'll cut this and make that hook into it and okay. voila. Well, I'm going to clean this shifter up while you're gutting that one. Okay. It's pretty. She's a beaut, Clark. Plastic screws. Blum! having dreams of shifting already oh yeah plastic screws so this is what they are go see what he's dreaming there I'm just trying to figure out if it's gonna be smack dab in your way when you're it's probably not gonna be bad I will tell we'll see what we can do with it I try that real fast see if we can tap you that just want to hit something Mainly that. <laughs> Your dad. <laughs> when it gets out of place and then it hits your hand oh, with a no hammer, good. that's always uh, the worst. No. Don't let me cut your finger off. I won't. I've been known to be, be a little wild with the drill. <laughs> Told you. That hurt. Did it? No, a freaking oh, metal sliver. No, I'm like, metal did I drill through you? Jeez, I about had a heart attack. I thought I you drilled his finger. <laughs> Gotta make sure Safety glasses. Okay. Safety check, gentlemen. Oh, I broke the whole bottom out. Broke the weld out. Good. It was meant to be. Okay, we'll get that figured out. How goes the battle here? It goes. Yeah? I am gonna knock this pin out. Then we can pull all this stuff off and take the switch out of it. Oh, yeah. Then we can lay it down in here and mark our pattern out. Okay. 
Some yeah. sweet pit vipers. Those are the ones you got out of the lake. Uh -huh. <laughs> he found some pit vipers. Went on a recovery and he scored him a set of pit vipers. Really? Yep. Yeah. Whistling Diesel probably wore those. Probably not, but, but you never know. <laughs> Got him. Yay. Well, now what? That you've done that? I don't know. That's as far as I got. I was hoping it'd just go and then it would be apart. I see. Well, just let her soak. Figure it out tomorrow. It's quitting time. The next day. All right, let's get this the rest of the way out here after it's setting all night. Just like that, nice. There we go. All right, let's see what that looks like. Let's go cut some things. And here comes that art glass in again. See if things line up now. Nope. I got him. You'll have to use it from down there. <laughs> Another part and piece we needed. Yeah, if we take that little piece, we'll straighten this. Just weld that right to it. Yeah, I think so. Rock and roll. Hold yeah. my Mountain Dew. I'll get it. <laughs> Hey, thanks. I'm gonna go back and check on my motorcycle project. It's done leaking. All right, we'll cut that off right there. And then we weld our little tab on her. I'm gonna see how much adjustment we got on the bottom. Oh man. Maybe. The valves may need to be adjusted a little bit, it sounds like. Now she's good. We've got some some stuff to do still. There's a couple things. But it runs. Now all I gotta do is finish it. Aiden will be it. ripping it around. Not a lot of adjustment on our cable, so we're having to get it just perfect. We got maybe half inch of play <laughs> but we're we're pretty close assembly goo everybody was asking in the comments what that is what this is yeah it's assembly lube for trans octa transmission assembly lube makes everything slide nice and easy should cover everything up it's shouldn't gonna it? mostly cover it we can we got our I work think... cut out making it beautiful when we're done there we go We're gonna test out this stuff. It's supposed to make motorcycles look brand new. This Pretty good, really. We'll see what it what it dries out to be. All right, we'll see what that looks like when she's dried up. Wow, that looks amazing. Oh yeah, she's beautiful. Gold nugget parts are shiny again. Look at that. That's gold nugget approved right there. Looks pretty new. That's All right, well, I'm going to get the mail. See if we got parts. That part will be right there. Yeah, I think that'll be good. It's a never ending battle of parts. Still sucks in case you're wondering to get in here. But I'm in. A thousand times better. Okay. I like that shifter. That's going to be okay. That'll work. We're going to have all the creature comforts except room. That dash and that cigarette tray look awesome. I'm telling you what. I like it. It looks way better than the radio in there. Yeah. Okay, well, I guess let's finish this thing. Let's do it. We've dreamed long enough. It really might. You have to have a hook and just... Wow, I fit perfect. <laughs> <laughs>
Yeah, you could drive this thing, huh? <laughs> All right, bail out of there. We're gonna get this shifter built. Whoa. Maybe the mail came through today and we've got some plugs. Um, I did something right. Say them words. I did something correct. Not a brand new helmet. You did? But I want to be the first one to burn with it. <laughs> brand new, huh? Brand new. Yep. That's one thing I won't skimp on. You gotta have helmets. Is welding helmets. My eyesight's too important. Good She's one. She's good. Perfect. Little nod. She's down. If he's eating my chips or not. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, I think it's perfect. Look at that. The parts guy showed up. Chad's man. Yes, sir. Sweet man, See thank you. See you, See you later. See ya. See ya. Popping sparks in his dip. Jose? <laughs> Save it, don't worry. That's what you get for hiding it from me. <laughs> this spring Will it be on more? spring watch? Yeah. Hey, the snap-on guy. Open Maybe. that thing up a little. Well, how are you? Good, how are you doing? I'm not too bad okay. at all. Good deal. Do you think Ben can break that? Yep. Probably that bigger green one right there is just fine. Okay. That'll probably do us. Toy box? Can you break that one? Yes. <laughs> See it? That's exactly what I said. <laughs> wow. It's cheap, Michelle. It's cheap. <laughs> thank you. Yep, thank you. We'll see you next time. Sounds good. We'll see if Ben can break that. He says he can, but they'll warranty this one. Cleaning the nasty off of the shifter boot. So we were asking you guys which is the best uh, stepper bits. Mark Bridges sent us some stepper bits to give a test to. These are Milwaukee's. He actually sent us an Irwin too. Good. We'll let you know which one we like. Speak to me, Goose. All right. Did you slave on it all day? Speak to me, Goose. All right. We'll come meet it. Bye. She says there's pizza up there. Okay. Brought us pizza. Smells like pizza. I need to wash my hands so there's no one who's mad at me. You always gotta wash your hands when you get back from the shop. Oh yeah, that's better. It's like we mend it. How's she feeling? Oh, that's pretty mint. Let's hook a cable into it and see if it works. Functions. We did this correct. And it's supposed to fit, right? We'll get that in there and build the sides for it. She's gonna look good. Brum, brum, brum. Well, we've got just a dark, neutral, drive, second. So I need first. We need first and park, and we have nailed this thing. Ow. All right, put it in park. I can't. It won't go? No. Okay, so we've figured the problem out here. We gotta drill these two rivets and move this back till it, all, till it touches, weld it back in. Then his design is perfect. Pass the crew! You know what song's in my head? Pass the crew! <laughs> Highway to the danger zone. Who has seen Top Gun yet, the new Top Gun? Was it so good, you guys? It was really good. It wasn't so good enough that it made me cry like someone else. I may have shed a couple of tears. It was a little emotional. And I loved every minute of it. Tom Cruise with no shirt on. Miles Teller, one of the two. Dude, Tom Cruise, Tom Cruise looks good for a 59 year old. I'm not gonna lie. You guys have your work cut out for you. All of you. Look at me. <laughs> Got him. Park. That's first. Next. Fixed. We're just uh, letting Michelle set in here so she can get a feel for how uh, big this thing is. Let's give her a go. I 
could so drive this thing. I fit just fine. What's your problem? How's the shifter? That's good. The only thing that would make it better is if this could go up and down. We have a different steering wheel coming. Oh yeah, a littler one would actually be better. We have a littler one that's flat right across the bottom. Yep, that would be good. A littler steering wheel. I Shifter fit perfectly feels good. fine in this. I can't wait to drive it. Yeah, your head doesn't even hit the roof. Oh, I fit good. I told you I'd fit. Yeah. Watch me fit in here. Watch me whip. Well, okay. You got it. What are you complaining about? <laughs> We did it. Got the mark. A shifter. We're the amazing shifter builder guys. You know it. The next day. All right, so basically we need this to set fairly close to neutral. We're gonna make some pieces some similar to this. And they're just gonna weld right to the top of this. And then we'll bolt these in. We're gonna go ahead and see what happens here. He did a fairly good job. I don't do anything crappy. No crappy work out of land. That's right. Huh? Either if I, I do it crappy it. one time, I have to do it again until I get it nice. We've got ourselves a professional here, Are folks. Nice? Someone's been learning. We've got a professional. I'm seeing how high. high. Or plenty high. We yeah. only have to go a half inch. This ought to be fun. Well, it tapers in the back. It's going to be going to be exciting. I chronometer it. Okay. Walla walla. Look at that. We can make two identical ones. So, you guys notice I'm wearing my uh, 4th of July shirt today. Limited edition if you want one. Better jump on and check them out. Okay, if you'll cut those out, those will work. You know what I got? Let, Let me go shear. get this thing. He's got a shear. Oh, he's got a shear? We're going to drill and tap this real quick, and then we can just put it on here when we need it. Might ought to get a center punching device. I'll grab one. We're going to try this new hammer out that Michelle hasn't even seen yet. But don't you worry. She knew I bought it. How many of you guys go to the store and your wife knows before you check out what you're buying? It's insane. How's that hammer? It's pretty sweet. Put your finger down there. No. <laughs> Alright. Where's my tap magic? Oh, you already you got it. Out. Dude, I've tapped so much stuff with this thing. <laughs> It hey, makes, I've never seen him break one. Like it that. makes better thread. You're lucky. Skill is what it nah, is. He's man. never broke one with that. The only time he ever did it with his hand, he broke one. Oh, really? I'm telling you. I'm not joking. I'm like, I gotta be careful on this one. Clink! I'm sold. I'll yeah. tap him every time with that <laughs> thing, man. They First don't. time I did it when Dar was around, he told me. I was tapping his steering box on his Jeep. He's like, what are you doing? You're gonna break that. Well, I've done them with that and broke them. That's why I'm like, I don't know how lucky you're getting. <laughs> so it said in the instructional. That holds it. Yep. And then you just take and yard on this here handle. That's pretty. Pretty much okay with that. Yeah, it doesn't like to cut arched. Not at all. We can grind that. Yeah, that's like way that. quicker. She cuts good, doesn't she? Yep. Okay, I guess we need to drill holes in it. There's holes now. They're out of here. We've got to repair all these broken pieces here. So we scavenged some old plastic. I'm cutting little chunks out. We're just going to place it in there and then see if we can plastic weld it. But Paul went to get a part for that plastic welder, so 
we're gonna go from there. Did they have what you needed? Not exactly. They had a bolt so we can fix Ben's broken stuff there. But they're way bigger. We're gonna have to re-drill some holes. Okay. There's your clips. Oh yeah, there. Which bigger may? Uh, be that'll be all right. Okay. Doing it? Yeah. We're making stuff happen. We'll drill a hole in it after we get it all welded in there. So, attempt number two. Better. I More went. Happier? I went overkill on this one, but hey, it's there now. Cool. So, okay, I'll make You're the a other plastic one. weld the some be. You know it. Is it just me or does it feel like the day's just blow by? They're rolling by. It's insane. I've been trying to get Ben to work faster, but. I've got you, one speed. And you can whip him all you want. Barely just, on. Like the tortoise, man. He's just barely going. You're pretty. Pretty okay, huh? Pretty good okay. Yeah. Hey, look at that nice new green chair. Hey, <laughs> get you a handful of those. There's the puke tank for the Nugget, we should be able to make that fit on there. Do what we need it to. We've been waiting for that. Steering wheel for a golden nugget right there. Oh, it's so it is three. Better. Oh yeah, that's gonna fit in there so much better. Go we'll hold that in there, see what she looks like. Can work, ain't it? Oh yeah. That's like a thousand times better than that. <laughs> Guaranteed to work. It'll either work or it'll break. Look better than you imagine? Yes. No, I like that. Right there. It's pulling the other side. We'll just weld that right there. Is it hitting? Nope. I'm gonna turn this cooler off so I can weld that stuff. Okay. Cools off, we'll put some plastic to it. It's pretty good. I like that. Should we, we set it that? in and see how it looks? Yeah, I think we're gonna need to. Needs trimmed off to make that fit down in there and then it's gonna be good. Let me find my marker. I think we'll 45 that thing up. Make life way easier. If we just took and go like this. See, that's why you get paid the big bucks. Yeah. Yeah, I think we just cut that off all the way across and weld a piece across it. Done. Here's the gap filler piece. We got us a new cameraman. Randall, he's gone home. It's getting late at night, so Ben is the new cameraman. Hi. <laughs> just like that, I'll tack it in there. Just like She'll that. be there. See that, and it fills all the gaps. A little grinding, a little uh, paint, and she'll be beautiful. All right, a little grinding and some painting, and the golden nugget shifter is handled. So it's been a long day of her, a day and a half of her, yeah. of just the shifter. So. You guys think we're not moving fast enough? Well, a day and a half to custom build this shifter. And it ain't done yet. All right, we've got this little overflow bottle here. We're just gonna mount this thing right in here. We're gonna drill some holes. Okay. Just like that. Just like so. And that looks just Perfect. We'll put a hose on that right there. Come right off here and here, and we'll be good to go. Sent this orange hose. Won't be bad, will it? No, that'll be all right. It's not horrible. Done. Donezo. All right, she's painted up and ready to go back in the floor. We'll get it installed this morning and get the shifter done. It's like you've put this in a thousand times. Yep. Okay, she's in. Hey. We even cut that angle right. Okay. There's a shifter in the way. 
I didn't put it there. We can get it. We got quarter turners on all of them. Okay. Assemble the rest now. Okay. Now I just need to get the spring in there. Thing looks way better than the old one. Oh yeah, this is a whole better setup. We're winning. Yep. Shifter is shifter aided. All good. Yep. So in the last three days, we've got a ton of work done on the gold nugget. We got this shifter built, which took way longer than it should have, but I like the outcome. It, it works good. It's in a good location. We have narrowed down a steering wheel. It's not installed yet. We're waiting for parts. We've got a puke tank put on for the for the radiator. We've got a bunch of little stuff buttoned up under the hood. So uh, next time, maybe we'll hear it run. Thanks for watching.